Yeah. Hello everyone, welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. We this is the restless sows litter here. Uh, we've weaned them today. And also we've taken two pigs, two little piglets out of, that were in the, the fattening pens. Uh, those two right there, the two larger ones. They're not thriving, they're not doing well at all. So, because we're weaning these other piglets today, they're going to get special supplements in their feed, and they're actually getting special feed. Those little tiny little pellets there. It's a special booster feed for piglets that have just been weaned. And uh, the little red pig, or the little golden pig, he's kind of turned red now. He's not particularly thriving either. He's the runt of this litter. And he's kind of got that same scrawny, not thriving look as these other two. Uh, these two have been medicated. But I think they just need uh, a little more attention for several days. And so we've taken them out of the fattening pen that they were in. And we're going to keep them in here. These little guys are going to get their supplements for three or four days, kind of depending, uh, until you can see the the lime green poo there is uh, scours. We call it scours. It's not uh, it's not uh, solid yet because they've been on milk and they're it's still kind of uh, well we. <laughs> We had a name for that color in the diapers, which I won't share with you for the kids. But um, their feed, after they've been off their mother's milk for a while, their, their uh, number two should look a bit different. And so we're going to closely monitor that to make sure it doesn't turn into scours. It can happen when, they, when, they're, taken, when they're weaned and they're put on all commercial food. So these will be closely monitored uh, the supplements will stop when their uh, poo gets uh, the right color I put another sack of rice holes in here to make sure their mother uh, the restless sow singing sow I never did come up with a, a, a name for her that would stick being uh, her personality, she continually plays with the water in here, and so the rice hulls are a bit damp. And so I've put another sack in here to ensure they've got a dry, a dry bedding. <coughs> a nice dry place for them to lay down. I'm going to keep a close eye on them. Uh, these larger piglets, the piglets that we moved, have had all their shots. They've been dewormed. They've had their iron shots. They're just not thriving. Their litter mates are twice their size, maybe three times their weight. We'll keep you informed. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.